Hello, hello, joy to the world. This is your girl, Tammy B. Jones. Welcome to my channel and welcome back my favorite subscribers. Okay, this is a Dollar Tree charger DIY. It has been done before, but not this way. I've seen a really magnificent um, DIY on this charger and I can't dare duplicate it, but I will leave a link to that video because it's awesome. Anywho, I bought some lace ribbon, bling bling, some scotch super 70 adhesive spray glue and some glitter spray which you would find out that you really don't need and you'll need some scissors and as you see I'm already wearing my gloves now this charge is going to be made out of pizza pans can you imagine yes it's a piece of pan now you don't really have to do anything to this piece of pan you can just leave it as it is and put your plates right on top because it will look just like a charger when you set your table. However, I'm going to bling out mine with this ribbon. And it's a real simple, quick step. First, after you remove all the pizza labels, you dust your, your pans off. And then you begin to spray your glitter. Now, the only reason why I use this glitter is because I thought because it was lace, it would um, leave a lot of holes into the pan and I wanted every area to be blingy but I found out later that the lace did not show the glitter so don't waste your money on the glitter plus it jams so I only got to use probably a third of the pan before it stopped working okay so now that my pans are all sprayed what I'm going to do now is do you want to see how it blings? I'll show you how it blings. See, isn't that cute? But it's totally unnecessary. Um, okay, so what I'm doing now is getting ready to measure my ribbon. And you'll need about however many pans you buy. That's how many uh, measurements you'll need to go ahead and save time and cut them all out at once. That way you don't have to keep measuring them over and over and over again. This ribbon cut very easily. It's a lacy ribbon with glitter on it. Now they are shedding as I touch them, but once I spray them down, I promise you they will not um, go anywhere. They will not um, fall off or sprinkle off or just drip any glitter anymore. Okay, so I'm going to cut about eight of these and then we'll get ready to adhere them to the pan. And I'll show you how I do that. Okay, here's my eight. They were so easy to cut and I had a ribbon left over. Now that bling ribbon goes about 15 feet. You can also make some placemats with those. But I would suggest adhering them to a, some type of fabric. So now that I'm using my Scotch um, Super 70, it works wonderful. I put my ribbon on and I'm using the top to press it down and I let it dry first before I begin to cut. I saved one to cut on camera, but my neighbor showed up and she distracted me, which was fine. And we chatted while I worked on the project. So I'm sorry you didn't get to see how I trimmed them, but it was very simple. Just go around the edges until it's all gone. Isn't that pretty? Now, I'm not going to do anything else to these. I'm not going to put stones on them. You can mod podge them if you want to have like a plastic seal, but it's just three of us and nobody's making messes in this house. So um, I may still do it at a later date, but not today in this DIY. I did my eight and they came out great. Oh my gosh, look at them. Yes, you guys have to, you're gonna get used to seeing this little workstation because I will be using it quite often in the next two videos because I am filming all in one day, several DIYs. Isn't that beautiful? Now this is gonna be my Christmas plates. I've had these for about six years. They are Gorham's. I went everywhere trying to find them because um, they are discontinued. And I love this china. 
this fine china and it's beautiful and the silver really complements it now if you want to show off your charger you can try some clear glass plates and i thought this set would do wonders however i think i'm a diy this set also i think i might be DIYing these glass plates to a red and gold color because I want some red dishes. Well, guys, I hope this helped you. And don't forget to check the description box for any links that I may leave. Thank you. Bye-bye.